Hello, I'm Peter here. Just want to help with a couple of diagnosis videos we're going to do to try and help people where you have had an engine failure to work out exactly what it is. One that we're seeing a lot more of than what we're used to is broken crankshafts. Um, I think this is a lot to do with the result of adding boost. You can break anything if you, you know, obviously push it hard enough. When they do fail, it will normally be a genuinely, just a, all of a sudden erratic noise comes in. They won't have as much power as they used to, but it's really an erratic noise. They will still start and run, even though if the crank is broken, as they lock together, your Conrod like will clamp it and hold it together. You've got your thrust in place. So even though it is broken, they will still start and run. The engine will still turn, but you will get, if you look across here, obviously a very erratic noise. Um, there's two easy ways to find it. One of them is end float, depending on where your thrust will be on the crank. One end of the crank will have massive amounts of end float. So the crank will go from, as you can see, in the crack. Like a 1KD, 1KZ is very easy because the thrust is at the very rear main. So you'll only have end float towards the front. So if you grab your balancer and you can move it backwards and forwards, obviously you've got a lot of end float and that will be the issue. You will have no metal in the oil filter. As I say, it will still start. If you were to isolate a cylinder trying to track the noise and took away one cylinder, the engine will then start working against itself so the noise will get a lot worse. Um, reactivate an injector, the noise will come down a bit. Take it away, really erratic, really loud. So that's between the end float and, and that cylinder isolation making the noise worse is generally the easiest way to find it. Everything will do it, like anything, Nissan, Toyota, Ford, Mazda, they'll, they will all do it. But it's just one um, to, a lot of people get stumped with it. But anyway, if you need my help, please give me a call.